<laughs> hello, hell, hell, hello, 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 everybody, and welcome back to another Minecraft video. Today, I'll be. Well, you may be wondering where I am. Well, let me just tell you. I'm currently in this house. Um, as you can see. This is quite an amazing house, and let me tell you while I've been away, I've been working on this little Minecraft world. We are currently in Snapchat 15, 17, w um, uh, and these days, what I do is, uh, I just play on the snapshots, I don't bother about the normal versions, I play Minecraft on the snapshots. So, this is the, my base so far, so we've been playing it. Probably, probably about three hours maximum. This is probably about that. Okay. Okay, this is my base. This is the beginning base. This is the new base. It's the nether portal. It's the chicken farm. And yeah, so I feel like we're doing pretty good at the moment, you know, with the stuff we have. And I feel like, you know, I need to give you guys a tour. So let's get right into it. So we start in the spawn chunkish area, I think, maybe. This is where I think I spawn. I have no idea, but so we walk out onto the you know general area of our base. So as you come across, the first thing why does it do this? It's so annoying. All right, so the first thing you see is indeed the horse and the nether portal, which is very loud. Unfortunately, I can't be able to change that at the moment. So this is an absolute chain, isn't it? So this horse is a bit of a legend horse, I travelled far and wide to get him, probably a long way away. Let me ride. There we go, you see he's got decent jump height, he's got lovely speed, you know, great for riding around, and you know, you can get over stuff quite easy, you've got decent health, about the same as me, so he's a bit of a legend horse. And you know, you can't really beat him, he's just an absolute, complete legend, you know, look at those eyes. Beautiful. Oh, that's just projecting, isn't it? Oh, and in case you haven't noticed, look at the new horse texture design. Like, what do you think of that? I've got these tails weird and feet are weird and the saddles weird and it's all just weird. Like, if I take. No. Yeah. If I take all this tr trash off him, like, look at this. Look, he looks so different. Like, oh my god. Like, comparison in three. Two, one. Joking, I'm not actually going to do a comparison because that's that requires me quitting out, so I'm going to have to do that later. In the video, but all right. So here we have the cow. So I've been working on breeding cows in the general area, so to get them, you know, transporting in the area. So far, as you can see, I've torched up the area to make sure no mobs can spawn. It's completely spawnless. This is my mini farm, and I've been using this week to breed cows just to. Now I need to I need to get some books. I need some books for my enchantment table. And this brings me into the beginner house. So here we have the chests of loveliness. You know this bow I got from the stars and it's absolute legend. You've got my white bed, which you really can't get any better than that. Now there's still this glitch where you walk when you hop into a bed and it really ticks me off. This is the AFK spot. There's some mobs gonna kill me because I've been killed by a zombie once. AFK for my chicken farm, which is absolutely insane, you know, it's not as good as it could be, but you know, it's giving me a decent amount of chicken, you know, so let me explain this to you, essentially, hold on two seconds, so essentially, we've got these big boy chickens up here, which lay all the eggs that, um, you know, are quite essential to the team, and they lay all the eggs and go to the dispenser, now, when these daylight sensors here, activate or detect the change in the daylight, they dispense the eggs, but also at the same time dispensing the lava, rapid pace, boom, 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 and then it stops. And that means we don't burn the drops in the lava, and it's pretty legendary. So the chicken dies, any grown chickens that are alive die, and they get the drops, and bam, they're right there. So this is essentially the chicken farm. It's pretty legendary. Go check out, I think it was Exumavoid's channel. It's a bit of a legend. Alright, so going back into the starter house here, we have my furnaces. They're quite beautiful, got some stuff in them. Got my enchantment table, 
and this is my gold is locks to this chest of loveliness you know it's great it's amazing now if we go down to the mine we have got so yeah we're just going to keep going that's just a weird chunk problem I don't know what it does what it does it all the time and then you go here and there's nothing down there it's just but we got the strip mine so we go and it goes so far and we've got some music coming let's go that so we got it goes down all the way and it goes on for literally forever you can't even see the end of it it's just black but yeah i'm not going to walk down there because that's a very long way now if we head back up to the main base and yeah let's go get around it we're back up we are in the house and we're going into the main house now originally it looks it looks okay like you know it looks all right but um you know i'm not quite sure whether it's okay or all right but um i'm gonna take a tour into the house so what we have we've got the fresh pressure plates from the latest one of the latest star traps we've got the different colors and this is essentially also we've got a lovely balcony lovely view look at that and up here if we come up here this is where the fish farm is wait it's not there yet we still got to build it so that's what we will be doing today after i show you a couple more things so I'm on my horse, and if we ride in this general direction, yeah, we shall come across a desert temple. As we can see here, it has been looted. I did loot it. I got those books you saw in the chest from there, so it's pretty good. It's a mine that I haven't let seen. Now, if we go this way, ooh, get pranked, we shall come across a village. Now, we're just going to keep, just keep traveling and see you there in a sec. And we're here. Don't die, don't die, don't. All right, cool. And we're here in the village. It's very, very intense stuff, if you know what I mean. Now, as we can see, we've got some crops. This is where I got some, most of my crops from the start. Because I'm caring in kind of these villages. As you can see through these loved ones making babies. All right, so if we get off and boom. We got Mr. Villager number eight. You know, here's the Fletcher. No one likes the Fletchers, they're absolute uselessness, but you know. And this is a leather worker. He's a bit of a legend, because he's got leather. This is sheep. He's also a bit of a legend. Say bar. Bar. Alright. Now, so yeah, this is village number one. Now let's head to village number two, which is a very, very long way away. Uh, you guys remember that. Thank you. You guys remember that desert temple we were? Yeah, um, it's very far. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. You didn't see anything. Alright, let's head off into the imaginations of the land. So yeah, we're back at the house. Now, if we go in this direction, I hope my horse doesn't go in the river, because that would be an absolute tragedy. So we're going to have to do a uh, sick parkour moves. Ready for this? Ready for this? Ready for this? Wah! I, I don't even know what that was, but yeah. Okay, in this direction, as you can see, we have got village number two. Which is an acacia village with all that beautiful orange. Everyone hates it. I kind of hate it. It's okay. Oh, I hear you. Good horse. So here we are. It's pretty lovely, you know. Still, not a blacksmith. Yeah, so we've got some lovely, pretty cool looking mountains over here. I'm not going to fall in the This is also where I got my horse from. Say hi to your friend's horse. <laughs> Alright, let's go. And that's a weird pathway. But yeah, this is some mountains which we'll explore later. Maybe build another base up there, which is pretty neat. But yeah, let's make our way back to the land of the house. And here we are, back in the land of the house. Ooh, let's go. All right, we are here. Eat your hay horse, I hope you enjoy it. And we are going to chop into the nether to see how we go. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Yummy. Now, if we can see here, wow. Very loud, I'd try to clear this bit to make it a bit more beautiful. To the eye, so this is the nether region. I haven't done much yet. 
just mind a bit of quartz here and there, don't worry about it. And uh, yeah, so let's get on to what we were meant to do today, which was to build a fish farm. Mm. This is amazing, great stuff. Alright, so let's get started. Alrighty, so here we are, we are going to get into the fish farm. Now, the first things first, above said fish farm, shit. I don't have any glass. Absolute tragedy! I'm going to go get some glass now, and then we will start the fish farm. Alright, now we can actually start the fish farm, because we might actually have some glass this time. Woo, get around him. So, first thing you're going to want to do is, this is going to be off-center, because this is based around a 2x2 two two thing. So, it is, I believe, hold on to six, by the four blocks wide, Forward, so one, two, three, four, and seven blocks across. So we'll go one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Absolute beautiful. So this is where we are going to do the fish farm today. So first things first, this is where the water will go, and the water requires direct access to sunlight. So unfortunately, we have to mine this block. And place some glass there because it needs direct access to sunlight. Absolute tragedy, don't you reckon? Alright, so let's get around and we're going to start with. Oh, I don't have a slab. Let me get you a slab. But let's go. Wood log. Bam. I need another wood log. There. Bam. Um, we're gonna need two wood logs. There. Bam. Another wood log there, bam, that is where we'll place our water. We need a wood log there and an iron trap door. This scientific reporting. So, iron trap door goes there. And we need a note box. So, you can go up there. Mind you, so you can look pretty. Boom, boom. Alright. You do not need to be here anymore. Because I know you like the old so fishy farm. You can beep again. Why is it? No! That is danger hazard. This must be fixed. Right, let's go. Um, I need. Actually, no. No, this will be fine. Alright. I just need scaffolding blocks so I can scaffold up. And let's be in now. So, also, we need a block. Right here. Now, I reckon if we place it that way, it will look like eyes staring at you. It should be pretty pretty, on my opinion. If I do say so. Does that look alright? I don't know. I'm not very good with my block placions. Oh my, why is it? It keeps doing like boop. For some reason. There we go. Alright, ah, get around him, so we got that, we're going to need a tripwire hook, it does, I'm absolutely certain, so, we're going to need to place you one thing, a good thing, because that looks amazing, doesn't it, yep, just complete, it looks like a big throne, like, look at me, I am absolutely beautiful right now in my throne, look at me, no one would dare mess with me, so I'm in my throne, let's go. We also need a node block, which will go on that position there. Now let me just grab myself a node block. Alright, yo, so it turns out, um, I got my node block, but it turns out, we are one too far forward. So, we're going to have to fix this slight issue by bringing everything forward. By one. And that is that part done. So it's a shame we had to move forward, you know. Didn't look at the tutorial properly, but <laughs> gonna have to deal with it really, you know. Life throws you problems and you make lemonade. So what we need is we need this needs to come out the back of the 
thingy-mobile, whatever it's called, I'm not sure what it's called, don't ask me. And then this one comes out this way, I do believe. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, oh. no, oh. <laughs> yeah, so yeah, you may hear a couple of sniffles in the video, but yeah, that's two, and that's good. There we go, All right? So, we need a bit of redstone, which I do not have on me. So, I'm gonna go grab some of that stuff, and all done and dusted. So, we have got the stuff, the goods. And if we make our way up, we should, I believe it's tripwire up the top here. Uh, here we go, and we've got a repeater coming around here. Peter coming around. Yeah, increase the ticks a bit for some strange reason, but alright. Bam, bam, bam. Bam, and I need a water bucket. Water. You've got the bucket, and we shall make the way to the ocean. Back up to the top. Boom. Water has been placed. Now, essentially, we're done. So, ah, uh, we probably need a hopper. Hold on, two secs. Alright, so we're going to need a couple of hoppies. So, back down to the basement we go, hopefully. We should all be pretty much done soon. Done ski, mate. One for the hopper and one for the chest. Chest. So, all right then. Maybe I don't need a redstone. Yeah. Ooh. Tragedy. All right. Um, you could pop some stairs here. Can you place it? Wait, no, you don't need it. All right. Cool. Actually, but I will still place stairs here. Um. Oh no, but then it's facing that way. Ah! <sighs> Wait, can I just do that? There we go, that's a lot neater. Alright. Thank you. Two, alright. And if I put break you, I can get the hopper and... Ah, there we go. Alright. That was a lot of effort and I dare say this fishy farm is officially Dunsko. Dunsko Munsko. Wait, shoot. There we go. Alright, let's get do a test run of the fishing expedition. So we stand here, aim at the trap door, and you've got to be kidding me. All right, good thing we did test runs, so we can. Uh, test these things. I don't want to be stuffing around with shoot like this. So now, if we do our test run, aim at the trap door. There we go! We just sit here until a fish comes or something we manage to grab. There we go, we got something. So, if we look in the chair, no, no. 
you got a fish, you got some cod, so there you go, that is the fish farm. So, next video I will be hoping to build an underground base to go to the farms area. This is just a fish farm area, just this area, it's going to be nowhere else. And also we are going to, um, bam, bam, place a block on top of this so it actually shuts up. But I would like to thank you all for watching this amazing fish farm video. Hope you guys enjoyed this first episode of my survival world. Let me know if you want more. And um, like, subscribe, do all that YouTube stuff. And I'll catch you all later. See you guys. Woo!